guys, welcome back to the bloodshed. So, I don't know what we're calling this yet. <laughs> we didn't think this far ahead. Nope. But, we have sharp objects. We're gonna throw them at the dartboard behind us. And we're gonna use that number to choose a movie off Shutter. That is what we're doing. I don't know what we're calling this yet. <laughs> but, I'm gonna switch this around and show the dartboard. He's gonna throw the dart. Not me, because I want to live. <laughs> <laughs> I feel a little safer with him throwing the dart than me, but not much safer. Uh, Alright, you good? I'm good. Alright, All right. sorry about the odd angle. <laughs> but this is where the tripod fit. So here's the dartboard. You ready? I'm ready. Alright, you go ahead. Alright, Mulligan, pick up the dart. <laughs> Wonderful. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> all right two we're watching number two okay all right so here's our little tv setup in the shed with uh shutter open and number two easy enough right here is 1989 overnight workers at a grocery find themselves pursued by a deadly maniac it is called intruder i don't know this one i know most 80s movies so this should be a treat. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. All right, so next time you see us, we're gonna be back in our seats and after watching this. <laughs> All right. All right, we're back and that was amazing. <laughs> that was wonderful. <clears throat> I can't believe I never heard of this before. The lighting's a little weird. We're, we're trying some things, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm not sure about how reflective ring lights are in glasses. I don't think of it as the experiments. experiments. Yeah. <laughs> I like the red light in the back though. I like mm. that. That looks cool. Good addition. Anyway, the movie. I had never heard of this before. Have you ever heard of this before? No, me either. No, and I'm very surprised I didn't because <laughs> I love this. Like, it could have been shorter. Like, there were some things that could have been slimmed out, but it was hilarious. It was. Especially when you get rolling at the end of it. Now, there's going to be spoilers, because whatever. But, yeah. Uh, that was fantastic. Was... <laughs> the kills were great. Yeah. What was oh, your favorite one? Oh, my God. Favorite kill. Oh, my God. I got so many, <clears throat> but it, I would have to go with <laughs> it's a tough choice. Like, <laughs> really? Oh yeah, I know. There were so many. Um, I'm surprised nobody went through the meat slicer. Yeah. But Buddy did go with the hacksaw. I like, or not the hacksaw. What's that? Oh, uh, bandsaw. Bandsaw. Yeah. 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 That was pretty. <laughs> that was pretty funny. <clears throat> I think my favorite one though was um, the compactor. The baler, the yeah. cardboard baler, mm -hmm. that was wicked. Yeah. See, <clears throat> what makes this extra funny is that Mr. Man's day job here <laughs> is a grocery manager, <laughs> and I have worked several years in grocery stores, <laughs> in retail yeah. stores. Yeah. So, <laughs> so we were getting a little bit of extra <laughs> entertainment about the hardships of the people stocking the shelves. Yeah. <laughs> the laundry detergent kept oh, falling down. Yeah. I felt that. <laughs> I did when he cut the box and cut into the product. Mm -hmm. Like, nope, don't, no, don't, don't do that. Don't case cut your boxes. No. Not if there's bags. There. All you had to do was open the flaps. Just you got to open flaps on and those, man. That's, 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 right. <laughs> yeah. that's a common thing. That the cereal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the yeah. <laughs> Why are you stacked on? Like, oh my god, I need to fix it. <laughs> but no, my favorite kill though would have I would have to go with the bandsaw because it just he just grabbed his head and just went. <laughs> but the the aftermath of the bandsaw was the best one when he she is. finds his head. Yeah, and it's like, whoop, <laughs> like the mouth yeah. is like yeah. just a little yeah. off. He looks like a fucking Muppet. It's great. The uh, practical effects are amazing. Like, <laughs> it's it's your typical 80s, late like, 80s. But. The director of this is the same guy that directed Evil Dead 2. Yes. And I do believe he worked on Evil Dead 1 with Sam Raimi. So I guess, and that's, this has the same kind of feel. It has yeah. 
that really slapsticky humor to it oh. that I absolutely love about these kinds of movies. Especially when the actual killer gets revealed because the whole premise is this grocery store is shutting down, the night crew is in the stock of shelves, and <laughs> this Missy, the, 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 what's her name? Jennifer. Her yeah. name is Jennifer. Yeah. I'll get some of the names. Most of them I want. Mm. But Jennifer's ex-boyfriend just gets out of jail for killing somebody, which he got a year in jail for because it was an accident. It was an accident. Not really sure how well that <laughs> tracks, but okay. This guy gets out, he's a complete asshole, comes in, kind of attacks her. They kick him out, and lock the doors, call the cops, all that shit, but he doesn't leave. And then he gets in back into the building after her, and people start dying. You think it's him. Obviously, like, I, I kind of figured from the start it wasn't going to be him, because he had red herring written all over him. Like, all over him. <laughs> so I kind of figured it wasn't going to be him. It ends up being the assistant manager dude, because they're selling the store, and apparently this, he, he really loves this store. Oh, very much He loves so. this store. And she, because they're selling the store, and everybody's going to lose their jobs, he goes on a murderous rampage. Yeah. So that's going to make his things face, better. His face. His face is priceless. Yeah. Oh my god, it's hilarious. I'm just a little crazy about this <laughs> store. I'm crazy about this store. My head's falling off. Just the way he goes, oh my god. I'm good. No. I'm good. <laughs> um, <laughs> there's this one part. <laughs> we were actually talking about another part. And I look up, and I just look at him, and I'm just, is he beating a guy with a head? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> He's just wailing on Buddy, and I thought it was a sack of flour, and I realized he had a head by the hair. He's a whack a mole. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this is what we're doing. This is what Great. we're doing. It's wonderful. I loved it. It was fantastic. Oh, my God. <clears throat> Whew. Um, I'm laughing too There's much. just so much in that movie. It's just so amazing. <laughs> and I'm so sad. I never knew about this one before. It's so cheesy too. Yeah. Like, it's, it's so, this oh. is my kind of. This is yeah. This is definitely my kind of movie. It's like <laughs> I don't know. Chopping Mall makes <laughs> Evil Dead or something. Yeah. But like not supernatural. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> And because it felt so evil, evil Dead, especially with the Raimi just being there, and then Bruce Campbell shows up at the end, so that's fantastic. <laughs> but <laughs> I kept thinking that we were at the Esmart from Evil Dead. I kept expecting one of them to say Shop Smart, Shop Esmart, <laughs> but it's not Esmart, it's just like a small grocery oh. store. <laughs> and I'm not sure, but one of the vehicles looks like. The, what I call the Raimi car, which I can never pinpoint the like a, make and model, but it's, it's an Oldsmobile. Yeah. yeah. Uh, classic. I'm not sure. But it looked like it, but <clears throat> I don't know a whole lot of cars from that era, so not 100% sure. Mm. But yeah, that that's <laughs> that was Intruder. Intruder, right? Yeah. Yeah, it Intruder. Called. And it was good. It was really yeah. good. I'm definitely gonna what you say? I'm gonna watch it again while I'm less inebriated. Yeah. But like I gotta say, I'm gonna give it an eight out of ten because it's <laughs> what, such you're gonna a, rate it, are you? <laughs> really good movie. Yeah. If yeah, looking, definitely seven, 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 eight out of ten, definitely. You know, if you're dying in dumps or whatever and you're looking for something to just laugh at, yeah. that's the movie to turn on. I promise you, you will laugh at it. It's great, it's wonderful. <laughs> All right, so that's going to wrap that up. We're going to go, and we'll see you on Tuesday for Top Tuesday, yeah. 1986. Yeah. Okay.